And in goes the ball and the clock starts and uh, Jamaica come out with it very quickly. Oh, look at this. But in defence, Rory Torrey, he can't make a play on the ball. And it's Dougie trying to get forward, couldn't quite make it. Shane has a go at the shot. Here comes Kurt Chin. Kurt with a difficult near side backhander. He gets a good shot right onto the 30 yard line. Two Jamaicans there going for the under the net shot. Cameron doesn't quite make it. He just gets a little touch. Dan Keating in defence gets a touch on it. The ball's dangerously in the American goal, but Sam Clements gets a great backhand. Chris Fragomeni coming out the pack underneath the Australian flag over there. Chris on the boards. He needs to keep moving. You can't stop on the ball. You get into trouble for that. Bit like going down Thames Street and somebody's window shopping. You run into the back of them. You're not allowed to do that. So the ball's in the corner. Still Jamaica putting pressure on the American back line. Shane Chin picks it up. Shane coming across. He's within sight of the goal. Oh, he's gone straight across. Didn't quite get the shot he wanted. Here comes Chris Fragg. Can he get up the field for the American team? USA. Frit. Chris still got it. Chris bringing it up. Well done, Chris. It's right in front of him now. He's got a chance to move. Didn't quite get the shot he wanted. Cameron tries the backhand. Here comes Kurt Chin. Kurt, little backhand. Does he get it to himself? Dan Keating's onto it first. Dan puts it into the middle. Cameron met it. Sam Clements gets a little backhand. Everybody's feeling each other out at the moment. Not a lot of speed to the game. Wet field as well makes it difficult. Kurt and Rory fighting over it. Rory did, comes out better of that challenge. Rory's looking upfield. He's got a pass away. Look at this. The USA on their first attempt at goal. First attack. But Kurt Chin, brilliant defence from him. Look at that backhand. Anticipation from his brother. Shane Chin coming onto it. Dan Keating looking to get the ball. Shane does well. Look at that from Shane. Brings it in the back of Dan. Gives himself a little space. Dan riding him off. Shane trying to get the ball up the field. Cameron Waits coming in behind Shane. Good backup play. Chris Fragomeni picks it up for the Team USA. Chris Fragomeni. Chris. Needs to bring it to the middle. Doesn't get the shot. Sam's backing him up. Well played, Sam, on the near side. Can Sam just bring this along the back line? Oh, he's over the top of it. Little backhand there from Cameron. Bigger backhand from Shane Chin. Dan Keating there. Keeping the ball onto the Jamaican back line. Rory Torrey trying to turn it. Nobody's really getting the better of these first little skirmishes. They're sort of cancelling each other out. Sam Clements clearing the way. Here comes Dougie. Dougie. What a shot by Dougie Henderson, inviting Cameron Waits to attack it. We need Sam to get a good backhand on this one. Oh, he leaves it, and there's the first goal. The opening goal goes to Cameron Waits. Jamaica won. It's, it's nothing. It's nothing yet. They're really just literally cancelling each other out, playing one end to the other. But the field is cutting up big time, so we're definitely going to want treading in at the third, after the third chuck. All right, teams back to the middle, changing ends. The Reds, USA, going down towards the Jumbotron now. In comes the ball from Perry. It's just stopped there at the moment. Can Dan bring it out? Chris is making the run for him. Dan can't see where the ball is. And Shane Chin picks it up. Shane, he's going to try and turn it. He's got Rory coming at him. He's also got Sam Clements there. Sam. I think Sam's got the better of it. Sam's trying to pass the ball into the middle. He's got uh, Cameron with him. They take each other out. Here comes Shane Chin. Backhand from Shane trying to get his two Jamaicans away. Rory in defense. Lovely backhand from Rory into the middle of the field. And well anticipated from Sam Clements. Sam's got a real good shot at goal now. Can he get it away? He's got one little touch. Shane's trying to hook him. And the ball has rolled through the goal. It's one all. One all. Well played, Sam Clements. Good anticipation from you, Sam. On to Rory Torrey's backhand. Under the pressure of Shane Chin. All right, teams, back to the middle. And Perry's going to throw the ball in. Three minutes to go in this first jucker. Where's the time gone? Wow, what a shot from Shane Chin. Asking his Jamaican yellow players to attack that. There's Kurt over there. He's got Rory Torrey with him. Rory Torrey tries to back it along the boards. He just pops it over the board. So we'll get a Jamaican bring in. The umpire over there will drop the ball down on the 60-yard line and give Jamaica five seconds to play it. Shane's ready to go. The Reds, USA, have to be 30 yards into the field of play to give Shane room. Oh, it's met by Sam Clements. Shane... 
Sent it too close to Sam. Can Sam bring it up? No, he's run into Shane. Now Kurt's going to try and get it. Good play by Kurt. Kurt going around. He's on Romeo, this chucker. And it runs over the back line. I think this is the first hit in of the day. So the goal judge will put the ball down where it went over the back line, so slightly wide. And we'll have Rory Torrey bring it in. Jamaica have to be 30 yards into the field of play. He's got Sam in the middle. He's got Dan right way, way over here. He's gone for the Sam pass. Does he make it? Look at that. It's to Sam Clemens. Can Sam escape his marker? He's getting away from Cameron. Oh, it was a near side shot. Didn't manage it. Chris Fragg picks it up. Not enough, though. Now we've got uh, Dougie Henderson. Nice little backhand from Dougie. Oh, Kurt got a big hit onto it. Ran into Dan Keating. Kurt coming across the field. Dan going down the line. And the first whistle of the day. So that's the main foul in polo. The right of way. The line of the ball. Same thing. If you imagine, if you imagine that the uh, direction that the ball is travelling creates its own main road. If you're travelling along that main road, you have the right to the ball. If somebody comes in from a side road in front of you or crosses your right in any way, the umpires will blow a whistle. And here it is on the board. And uh, I'm just there it is. Yeah, Kurt just comes across the front of Dan. Dan was on the line, so it's a penalty to the USA. It's a 40-yard penalty, so it's an open goal penalty. Jamaica have to be behind the goal line and away from the goal mouth, and the USA, Rory Torrey, gets one shot. Rory sends the shot. Oh, he's pulled it just wide. Let off for Jamaica. So it remains one all. Not as easy as it looks, open goal, 40-yard penalty. Goal judge needs to put the ball five yards wide of the... Five yards wide. That's about five feet. Five yards wide of the post. There you go. Thank you. All right, Jamaica, first hit in. Let's see what their tactic is. Well, I can see the number two of Jamaica way over this side, totally unmarked. If they can get the ball to him, uh, Dan's noticed him and moved out. You can see them all marking each other. Here comes Shane, trying to get past Chris Fragomeni. He's got it to Kurt. Kurt sends it forward. Can he get it to Dougie? There's Rory Torrey in defense. Gets a cross shot. Trying to get the under the neck. Dougie does well, hooks his stick. Cameron tries to get her it. Who's turning quickest? Cameron. Chris Fragg is there. Cameron's there. They're fighting for it. Well played, Chris Fragameni. Chris Fragameni tries to get it to Rory Torrey. Rory on the near side. Bouncing ball. Gets away from him. Chris Fragameni does great. Gets away from Dougie. Dougie gets it, though. Now we've got Shane. Oh, watch. Look at this. Shane's going to back it right into the path of uh, Shane Chin. Kurt. Good backhand from Kurt to Shane. Shane. Oh, Shane. Let off for, for, for the home team, Sam Clements in defense. Great backhand from him to look at this, Rory Torrey. We're beginning to speed up, these teams. Sweating out last night's alcohol from a great dinner at the Midtown. And Rory Torrey picking it up. The two number ones taking each other out. Dougie does well, and they blow a whistle on him. We'll see what the umpires say there. All right, Ernie, what we got? It looks like uh, a penalty in favor of USA. All right, and the 30-second bell, 30-second bell, we all heard it. I'm sure everyone heard the 30-second bell go. Um, no. But anyway, the 30-second bell went, which meant we're inside 30 seconds, and when the ball goes dead, that means it's the end of the chucker. You know, we've only been doing this 32 years. We're trying to get better at it. Um, so the teams are going off to change their ponies. If you imagine, each pony probably travels a mile and a half, two miles each chucker. They're very fit, very well looked after, but they need a break, and they can come back out for a second chucker after a break of two. But most of these players will have a pony each for each chucker. Anyway, they'll go and change off. The, the word chucker is actually quite interesting. It's uh, from 600 BC. That's how old this game of polo is, 600 BC. And the word chucker is a Tibetan word, meaning round, as in like a boxing round, a, a, a round. And again, it's an open goal opportunity for the USA. Jamaica have to be behind the goal line, away from the goal mouth. And USA get one hit at this, and it looks like that Sam Clements, the Sam Clements, the Sam Clements with a straight elbow, will be taking this. He just walks up, no pressure, because he's got all the time in the world. 
and he slots it through the post. Well done, Sam Clements. Puts the home team into the lead. First time today, two to one. And the teams will come back to the middle and change ends, and uh, we'll get Perry Markell, who is umpiring with Ernie to throw the ball in between them. The yellows of Jamaica now going up towards the grandstand end. In comes the ball. Jamaica come out with it. Sam Clements trying to ride off Dougie there. Does well, but we got Cameron on the grey pony. Cameron for Jamaica picks it up. Looks like Rory does a great ride off on Cameron, but looks like Cameron's going to win it back. No, Rory's still that. Look at this ride off. It's good stuff. Rory just wins it. Chris makes a move. Chris Frag on the near side. Hooked out of it by Shane. Good backhand from Cameron. Can Dougie pick it up? Ah, Kurt might be able to if Dougie can get the hit. Dougie, oh, just gets the second shot at it. Dan Keating picks it up. Dan looking around. He goes across the field. Cameron's going with him. Dan's going to get the better of it, though. He's got the little shot, trying to straighten it up. The number two riding him off hard. Sam Clements has got a chance. He tries the under the neck. Chris Fragg hopefully will do a backhand here. No, he's going to slow down to a walk. Try and turn it around. He's got Shane Chin. No, that's, sorry, Kurt Chin giving him some grief there. And well played. Kurt did enough pressure onto Chris Fragameni. And Chris sends the ball over the back line well wide. Hit into Jamaica. So now the Reds, the USA team, have to be 30 yards into the field of play. Give Jamaica room to take this. And a very quick Hit in by Shane to his brother, Kurt. Kurt picks it up over the halfway line. Sam Clements rides him off. Sam's got the backhand. Nice centering backhand from Sam. Shane Chin's there. He gets the backhand. It's into the pile at the moment. Looks like Rory Torrey picks it up. Rory trying to go forward. He's got Dougie Henderson marking him tightly. He's slowing down Rory. Well played, Dougie. Rory's still fighting away. Dougie's still riding him. Very slow stuff. Everybody running into them now. Rory gets the centering shot and a great centering shot, but there's Shane. Shane needs to get the shot away. He does. He brings it right across to the far side of the boards right underneath me here. And Shane's going to try and turn it up. He's got Chris Frag keeping pressure on him. Shane gets the touch. It comes off Frag's pony. So I think the Jamaicans will get the hit in from there. And he blows his whistle. So lucky for the Jamaicans, it came off frag. They'll get the hit. Ernie puts the ball down, gives them a few seconds. And Shane Chin will bring it in. He's looking up. Where can he find an unmarked member of his team? Oh, he sends that a little straight, but it looks like Kurt's going to bring it up. Kurt does really well, puts it in front of Dougie Henderson. Hit Dougie, couldn't get there. Dan Keating gets a lovely backhand into the middle. Shane's there. Shane, can he pick it up to Kurt? Sam Clements just gets a touch on it. Sam, we're slowing it down again. We need to get moving. The field is very difficult for them. It is wet. It's slow. The ball is not traveling fast. Here comes Kurt. He's going to try the cut backhand, and he succeeds, and he puts it right to the two Jamaicans. Sam Clements puts his stick up in the air, appeals for the foul. He thinks he has the right of way. The whistle goes. It sounds like the umpires probably agree with him. So that is exactly what happened. The, uh, the Jamaican player should have played the ball on the other side of his pony. By playing it on the near side, he crossed over the line to make that shot. And so it's a penalty in favor of Team USA. And Rory Torrey, the number four, will take it. Jamaica, 30 yards from the ball, but they're all marking each other up. Chris a little open over here. Cameron coming over him. Dougie right in the front. Kurt over there. Shane with Sam Clements. See, no one can cross Rory's line. He's just taking it wide, so he gets a second shot at this. He's going to try and run it. Dougie's going to try and go with him. He's got a chance to center it. He's done very well indeed. He's got looking good here, looking very good. Rory, Tory. Wow, he made that look as easy. Three shots from Rory. Managed to avoid the man. And he puts the USA team three to one. With three and a half minutes of this chucker to go. All right. Jamaica now going down towards the Jumbotron. Who comes out with it? Jamaica come out with it with Shane Chin. Rory's going with him. Shane leaves it. Kurt's there. Kurt centers it. Lovely shot from Kurt. Trying to put it back to Shane. 
Rory tries to get the backhand, doesn't manage it. Sam Clements there. Oh, look at that. Lofted backhand by Sam Clements. That's a really good backhand right to Chris Bragameni, who anticipated it. Chris on the runaway. Couldn't get the second shot. Great shot from uh, Cameron. Rory almost met it. It's in the line for Kurt. Kurt. Kurt Chin. He's got Shane behind him. Kurt just taking his time. He wants to just line it up if he can. He's got room. Can he get past Sam? Lovely shot from Kurt. <gasps> Just wide, though. Good play, good play. But just wide. Hit into USA. Who's going to bring this ball in? Looks like Rory Torrey. Sam Clements making a run. Jamaica having a look. Chris. Dan Keating unmarked. Kurt going over towards Dan now. Rory looking up. Rory just tapping it. Anybody breaking away? No, they're all well covered. Rory's going to try and bring it to the middle. Rory's making a move. Kurt's got it on the near side. Well played, Kurt. What a backhand from him. Can Cameron wait to get onto it? Cameron. Yes, he can. He gets a little shot. Unfortunately, it comes off Sam's pony, goes across the field. He was trying to get under the neck towards the goal mouth. He managed to get the exact opposite to that, and he's right in the far corner underneath the flag of St. George's, the British flag. Or well, the English flag, I should say. Well played, Sam Clements coming out with it. Oh, the whistle's gone on him, though. I don't think Ernie, umpire Ernie, liked that. we got a minute 42 seconds. We'll see what he says. It's going to be a foul in favor of Jamaica. Their first foul today, or their first foul they've been given today, it's going to be a 30-yard penalty. So this time the Reds, USA, have to be behind the goal. And away from the goal mouth. Sorry, behind the goal line and away from the goal mouth. Here's a little replay going on. Oh, I've missed it. Too late. That was my own fault. So it looks like Shane Chin's going to take this 30-yard penalty. Chance to bring Jamaica within one if he can convert this. And like the other ones, he's just walking. He's got no pressure on him. Just needs a simple little swing. He's got it. He sent it. It's through the middle. Those goal posts are eight yards wide. It's one of the largest goal areas in any sport, which is hardly surprising when you're trying to hit a three and a half inch size diameter ball off a horse at speed. So all fair, really. And uh, Jamaica bring it within one, three to two. Now the Reds, USA, going down towards the Jumbotron. Just over a minute to go in this second chucker. In comes the ball. It's in the melee. Dan comes out with it. Dan comes out with it. He's trying to get it behind the saddle. Couldn't quite manage it. We have Dougie. Dougie sends the under the neck shot right to Kurt Chin. Kurt picks it up. Oh, it comes off Roy's pony. That's all right because Shane's there. Oh, it comes off Dougie's pony. That's all right. Cameron's there. Shane picks it up, turns it around. Shane going over to the far side underneath the Kenyan flag now. Kane, can he turn it from there? He's got... Uh, Sam Clements trying to get to him. It's still on the boards. He's got his brother, Kurt, trying to fish it off. Chris Fragameni gets the backhand. Look at that from Chris to Sam Clements. Sam's got a break. 30-second bell's gone. Can Sam finish this? He's got Shane at huge speed. Ball bounces, but it's still running. It might just get there on its own. It might just get there. It does. Sam Clements is excited. The Sam Clements over the moon by that. And another goal to the home team. So that makes it four to two. And the 30-second bell had gone before that. So the ball is now dead. The chucker will end. And in comes the ball. Shane tries to get touch on it. Doesn't quite manage it. But there's Cameron. Cameron waits. Oh, look at that shot from Cameron. Under pressure from Dan Keating. Can Cameron get it around the corner? No, it just hit the ground and stopped dead on him. It's all right. There's Dougie. Oh, he couldn't get the backhand. And Chris Ragamani's picked it up. Chris coming over the halfway link. Right, Chris looking at goal. Oh, he hasn't seen Shane coming at speed. Shane managed to stop that, but he's backed up by Rory Torrey. Rory didn't quite get the shot he wanted. There's a good backhand from uh, Dougie this time. It's picked up very nicely by Cameron. He needed to do that. Oh, he's left the backhand, though. Dan Keating's going to pick it up. Kurt does brilliant. Kurt somehow rides off Dan, gets himself a shot at the ball. Sam tried to get him, but he couldn't. Kurt brings it up the field. There's Cameron, has a big shot, doesn't manage it. Kurt does, though. Kurt, send it forward. We need uh, Cameron to get back to Rory Torrey. Uh, Rory, brilliant backhand from Rory. Takes it away from the goal mouth area. 
Shane Chin backs it back in there, though. Anybody anticipating that from Shane? Yes, Kurt, but Kurt's backhand is going to run well wide. Looks like uh, Cameron's going to try and keep it in play, but I think it's run over the back line, and we'll have a hit into U USA. Rory just putting the ball there. We've got a whistle, I think, so we've stopped the clock. He's coming this way. He's going across the face of his goal. It's dangerous, especially when Dan Keating runs over it. He's left it there. Both chins are there. And Kurt's going to go, thank you for that present, Dan Keating. You are wonderful, host. You gave that goal to Jamaica, three to four. Still in favor of the home team. But crikey, that was a big error. It's dangerous play to take the ball across the face of your own goal, obviously. And it's even more dangerous when your teammate runs into it and stops the ball and leaves it for two Jamaicans. So back to within one, three to four. In comes the ball. Reds going down towards the Jumbotron. Who's over there? Looks like uh, Rory's going to pick it up. Rory going to want to make amends for that little error. Here he comes out of the pack, bounces away from him. Shane gets the little touch on it. Kurt's there. Kurt gets a great backhand. Unfortunately for Jamaica, Sam Clements is already in position at the back. Sam slows down, gets a fantastic backhand right down the side of the field. Kurt's there first. He sends it right back up the field. Now this is a chance for Dougie here. Can Dougie pick it up? He certainly can. Sam Clements is waiting to ride him off. Sam does the ride off. Cameron gets a little touch. Can't quite get it to Dougie. Great backhand from Rory Torrey. Good angle on it. Dan Keating. And it looks like Shane Chin. Shane gets the first touch for Jamaica. There's Chris Fragameni. Chris trying to get it to Rory. Kurt's going to get there. Kurt's going to put it under Rory. Rory's got to get out of his way. It's got Shane. Shane calls him off of it. Shane sends the ball up for Jamaica. This is a big chance to even the score. It's just running wide. Cameron keeps it in. No, he doesn't keep it in play. Just runs out over the back line. Let's hope it's a good one. All right, here comes Rory. Brings the ball in. Four minutes to go in this first half. Bouncy Pony is on there, that's for sure. Can Rory get past... Uh, Dougie, he can. He sent the ball over the hut. Oh, unlucky for Rory. Just comes over a divot and runs out over the boards. So Jamaica will get the hit in. Umpire Perry puts the ball down. Jamaica. Sam Clements needs to be 30 yards into field of play here. Here comes Shane Chin. Shane sends a very powerful shot up for Jamaica to, to attack. Cameron's attacking it. Cameron got a little forward shot on it, is it? No, it's just run a foot wide. Couple of let offs for the home team. Jamaica beginning to get going. Gold Judge is going to put the ball down. Three American players behind the line there. Maybe a little discussion as to what they're going to do. Rory's going forward on that bouncy pony. I think he's just saying, I've got, I'm have got, i bouncing around too much. Dan, you take it. Dan brings it in. He's got three of his teammates up in front of him. Can he reach them? He sends a good shot up the field underneath the South African flag. They're coming later on this season. That'll be a fun game too. Kurt tries to get the backhand. I think it's gone over the boards. I think it might have gone off Dan's pony. I'm not sure. We'll see which way the umpires put this down. It looks like it's going in favor of Jamaica to bring it in. I think that's what happened. Came off a USA pony. We had, uh, uh, okay, so actually it's a red foul. All right, we're back to eight players on the field. Two minutes, 43 seconds of the third chucker of the first half. Here it comes, Shane Chin. Bring it into play. Where's his Jamaican teammates? They're all over here. What a shot from Shane Chin. It's going to reach Dougie. Can Dougie make the most of it? It looks like uh, Rory Torrey's going to ride him off. Dougie gets a shot on it behind Rory. Dan Keating gets a fantastic backhand away from the goal mouth. Right into the corner. Who's over there? Sam Clements. Sam stops on the ball. Kurt's there with him. Sam's going to have a shot to bring it across to the middle now. Sam trying to put his foot down. Kurt trying to hook his stick. Sam gets the shot. Sam at a full gallop. Look at that pony's ears. 
He's loving the... F oh, Sam didn't take the ball with him. That's all right. Chris Fragg's there. Can Chris Fragg have any? He's got to get this to the middle. He's got Rory backing him up. Chris goes round the back. Chris Fragomani got a chance. Chris Fragomani scores a great goal. Well played, Chris Fragomani. Sam Clement sort of set it up. Chris Fragomani did some great play there. A couple of really good shots from Chris. Puts the USA team five to three. With just over a minute and a half to go. Teams in the middle. Ball comes right through. Shane Chin picks it up. He's on it. Sam Clements trying to hook his stick. Does well. Looks like uh, Cameron Waits is there. Cameron trying to bring it to the middle. Over the top of it. Keating can't get it. Kurt Chin's got it. Kurt Chin's there. Oh, Rory Torrey just gets in there. And gets a little shot away from the goal area. Sam Clements is now onto it. Well played, Sam. Trying to get it back into Rory's seer. Kurt gets the hook. Cameron gets the little backhand. Does it reach uh, Shane? Dan Keating gets there first. Kurt's trying to meet it. How did Kurt meet that in the air? He's got time. He's got 59 seconds. He just needs to slow it down. Oh, he misses the cut shot. So does Shane. That's all right. Dougie Henderson. One after another, the Jamaicans back to each other. Dougie gets a good shot towards the middle. Runs into Rory Torrey, though. Rory Torrey clears it. Little backhand from Shane Chin. It's there for Chris Fragg and Dan Keating. Crikey, they're really fighting for this. 38 seconds. Kurt's going to pick it up. He puts it to Cameron. Cameron trying to get past uh, Sam. Cameron goes to the under the neck. There's the 30-second bell, and the ball has run out over the back line. Oh, my goodness. USA were lucky there. So the 30-second bell has gone. The ball has gone out of play. The ball is now dead. So it is half time. Please come and tread in, everybody. We need you out there to divot stomp. And here they come, second half, about to get underway. USA 5, Jamaica 3, Rory doing this cross the face of the goal thing. He's got Dan out of his way, so that's pretty good. He gets a nice pass up the field, but Dougie Henderson's first on it. Gets the backhand, Cameron can't make much of it. Sam Clements picks it up. Sam gets hooked by Cameron. Kurt's there. Kurt's going to try and back it to his brother. Doesn't get past Rory, though. Rory picks it up, he's going across the field. Here's the number one for Jamaica. What an under the next shot from Dougie Henderson. Kurt's running onto it. So is Rory Torrey, though. Rory's got the backhand into the middle. It's met brilliantly by Cameron. Cameron Waits going forward. Dan Keating going with him. Has he got some backup? He's got Kurt there. Shane's just to finish it. Shane pops it. He does. What an angle from Shane Chin. Wow, Jamaica coming out with intent. Not letting the U.S. out of the Jamaican half. Back to within one. Four to Jamaica, five to USA. We're going to use the tee over on this side just to give the field a break over there. So we'll have uh, umpire Ernie throwing the ball in for us. Jamaica going up towards the Jumbotron. USA going down to what? Sorry, J Jamaica going up towards the grandstand. USA going down to the Jumbotron. And looks like uh, Dougie gets the first shot on it. Rory. Oh, Cameron landed on his butt. I think that was just an overbalance. Horse stopped. Can In it goes. Comes out in favor of the USA, but Shane's onto it very quickly. Shane sends a great backhand for one of his team to attack, but Sam Clements is there, and Sam sends a very strong under-the-tail backhand, only as far as Shane Chin, who sends one right back at him. Now we got Kurt, Dan Keating, Cameron. They're all coming towards it. Dan Keating got caught on it. Cameron's done really well. Can Cameron get away with it? Cameron has. He sent it towards goal. This is looking good from Cameron. Rory's going as quick as he can. Cameron's just tapping it. Does Rory get the back end? No, he doesn't. Cameron finishes it off. Wow. Cameron just landed on his butt, and he's right back in the saddle and right back at it, and he levels it up. Five all. Game on. And Ernie just getting the teams to line up. All right, in comes the ball. Jamaica now going down towards the Jumbotron. And Kurt, Kurt Shin comes out with it. 
but Sam Clements is winning the ride off. Sam's going to try and get the back end. Gets a touch only as far as that Cameron. Can Cameron score a second one so quickly? Surely not. Rory stops him. But <laughs> he Rory stopped Cameron, but they didn't stop Shane Chin. Jamaica come out firing at all cylinders. That's three quick goals from Jamaica in this first opening minutes of the second half. Jamaica six, USA five. Shane and his lucky belt. Teams lining up, waiting for umpire Ernie. Reds going down towards the Jumbotron now. In it comes, bounces out in their favor, but Cameron, no, that's uh, Dougie's gonna be there first. Dougie turns it. Dougie's got a chance to send it up the field, he does. Sam Clements going back. Sam's gonna look, what's he gonna do? Hopefully a tail backhand, there it is. It's a beautiful tail backhand. Kurt somehow got there on the end of that. How did he do that, Kurt? Kurt Chin turns it brilliantly. Is he going to put another goal on the board for the Jamaicans? Are you kidding me? What is going on with this Jamaican team? That is another goal for Jamaica. Now they've turned a two-goal deficit into a two-goal advantage. Seven to Jamaica, five to USA. That's amazing. It took Cameron to throw himself on the floor, and everything's gone right for Jamaica since. All right, here we go. In comes the ball. Chris Fragameni's got it. Surely the USA can respond with one goal or something, this chucker. Kurt's back there, though. Kurt's looking. Oh, he went for the cut backhand. He's left it for Sam Clements. He took his time. Sam Clements has picked it up. Sam Clements gets the goal. Huge excitement. Six to seven, but Jamaica still hold the edge. Three minutes to go in this chucker. And where are we? We're back to the middle. Reds, USA going down towards the Jumbotron. Jamaica in yellow, up towards the grandstand. Dan Keating trying to get it. Jamaica come out with it. Shane Chin's on it very quickly. Rory rides him off. Sam Clements picks it up. Sam Clements still got it. Kurt's coming towards him. Sam tries to put it backwards. Rory runs into them. Someone needs to move. Look at this. Rory coming out with it. Oh, good hook. Whistle's going. Didn't like that. I don't know what Ernie's going to do. He's looking like he's moving forward. He's going to point forward with it. I think he didn't like what Kurt did to Rory. I think he might have just run over the ball or something. We'll see where Ernie's pointing. It looks like a 40, maybe. He's pointing at the 40 or the 30. It's going to be an open goal penalty in favor of the home team, a chance to level it again. It is a 40-yard penalty, so it's an open goal penalty. Sounds easy. Sam Clements. Sends it straight. It is easy when you're Sam. That Sam Clements. Seven all. Seven all. Two, just under two and a half minutes of this chucker to go. All right. What a chucker. We've had like goals galore this chucker. How many goals we had this chucker? A lot. Six goals in one chucker. That's amazing. Balls come out in favor of Jamaica. Cameron trying to get onto it. Cameron's got a chance. Rory comes across. Rory gets the next shot. Rory going forward. Rory going forward. Is he going to put the USA back in the lead? Oh, it just ran away from him. He got the head on it. It's hitting the post. It doesn't. It just squeezes in. Wow. What a chucker. This is crazy stuff. Eight to seven. Seven goals, one chucker. Wow. Jamaica come back strong. Four unanswered. USA answer. Wow. They've certainly opened up the game. They're not marking each other nearly so tightly. They're giving each other room. And now we've got goals galore. Crazy. Dan Keating coming out with it. Dan on the near side. He's got Cameron going with him. Dan Keating within 20 yards. He's just got to make the hit. He makes the hit. Keating scores. What on earth is going on? Goal to goal to goal to goal to goal. Seventh goal of this chucker. USA restore the two-goal lead. And the 30-second bell's about to go. We'll see if Ernie gets the throw off, throw in off before the 30-second bell goes. It'll be tight. Yep, he should be able to get it in. There it is, it's in. 
And Sam Clemens tries to come out with it. It's under a Cameron there. Kurt, but Dougie trying to pick it up. There goes the 30-second bell. Who's going to come out with it? Sam Clements has got a chance. Kurt Shin gets a little touch on it, but Sam Clements manages to pick it up. Can he get the cut shot in towards the middle? He's got it away. Is it good? It's good. Oh, my goodness. Another goal for the home team. That's double digits now, 10 to 7. Eight goals in one chucker. It's phenomenal. And anyway, that will end that chucker because the bell had gone. The teams will go off and change their ponies. We've got a couple of birthdays coming up. What have I got at the moment on here? Andrea Lopez, happy birthday, Andrea. 44th anniversary to Robin and Peter, 44th to be here. But it would be more fun if you were here and you can have a dark and stormy or a something drink, I think. You know, you can get the latest drink from Absolute, apparently, if you join us. And in they come. And Sam Clements, is it really Sam Clements? It's just turned into a goal fest. Now Sam Clements puts USA 11 to 7. What on earth? I've never seen polo like this. Jamaica 4, then USA have answered with like 6. So my over and under of 19 is going to be well gone. Oh my goodness. Anne Clements looks like she could be taking the pennies home with her today. All right, in comes the ball through the pack. We need some action from Jamaica they must be wondering what on earth happened they must be very happy with their team talk the way they came out the second half overtaking USA and then they've just been swamped right Sam and Clements over there Oh, sunshine's coming out that's nice Sam Clements runs over the top of it Shane no that's Kurt Kurt Chin's gonna fish the ball off the boards if he can Rory's there with him he gets the ball off he comes across the field he's now heading up the field Bouncy Pony sends a good shot. Forward, look at this. He's come through the pack, and that is Dougie. Is that Dougie? I think that was a... Uh... No, that is, sorry, that's uh, Cameron scoring that for Jamaica. Cameron waits. Good pass up there from... Good pass up there to him from uh, Kurt. Who's, who was... Uh... I don't know who he's riding this chucker. Where we are? Where's my pony list? There it goes. Ball in. Dan can answer straight away, is he? Dan comes out. Nobody's marked him. He's just got out all free. Kurt's there to hook the stick. Shane tries the backhand. Cameron does get the backhand. Rory's there. Unfortunately, Dougie didn't attack him quick enough. Rory goes across the field. He's going to try and turn it up. Dougie's doing enough. Sam Clements comes across to help out. Well played, Kurt. Kurt's got it. Chris Fragg gets it back. Chris tries to put it towards the middle, but the ball runs over the back line. Crikey, finally a hit in. It's not a goal. How boring. <laughs> Unbelievable. All right, goal judge puts the ball out. There it is. And Shane Chin on the grey pony. Shane is riding sassy, this chucker. This is a pony that Minnie Keating plays very well. Look at that hit from Shane. That's a gorgeous hit. It's going to get all the way up to Dougie Henderson. Dougie sends it on to Kurt. Kurt picks it up for Jamaica. Kurt coming through. He's running wide, though. He's not going to keep it in play. Oh, he is going to keep it in play. Oh, my goodness. Rory gets a little backhand. It's met by Dougie. Dougie puts it through the goal. No, I'm sorry. That's, that's Cameron puts it through the goal. Oh, my goodness. What play from Jamaica. Where did that come from? I'm just confused by this whole game. It's just, you think one way's going that way and then it just blows open again. Great fast play by uh, Kurt. He's on one of uh, Roger, Clement, uh, Roger Soto's ponies, this chucker. Good, good horses, good mounting. In comes the ball. Can Jamaica get another quick one? They need it. They need it, and we've got uh, Cameron Waits coming around. Cameron doing really well, just avoiding Dan a bit. Rory's there, though. He's going to do the tail back and get it towards the side. Sam Clements and Kurt's there. Kurt trying to get to it. Where is it? Can't see it. Oh, it went over the boards, hit into Jamaica on the 60-yard line. Shane's ready to take it. Ernie puts the ball down. He can attack the goal from here. Look at him go. He's going to send the ball straight. It's running straight. Rory gets a touch and sends it out wide. 
but we're going to have the equivalent of a soccer corner when the defender hits the ball over his own back line. In Polo, we have a safety. So the ball is put on the 60-yard line where it went over the back line, so not in the middle of the field, just over to the side here. Good defending by Rory to send that ball out over the back. It was going, it was very much goal-bound. And so Jamaica will get to bring the ball in after the defender hits the ball over his own back line. Shane must be wondering, what do I have to do? He set a great shot straight at goal. All right, so Jamaica, either side of the goal mouth, just if it's going wide, they'll try and tap it back into the middle. USA defending this. They've got to be 30 yards back. Sam Clements in the front line. Three reds in the goal mouth trying to get, try and stop this. Shane gets a lovely shot away. Sam gets a touch. Kurt's there. Can Kurt make touch? No, he can't. Dan Keating's trying. Chris Fragomeni's trying to get away from uh, Dougie Henderson. Dougie gets a shot. It's a bit of a melee. And uh, I don't know. Chris is the only one going that way, and everyone else is going the other way. So I, I don't know what the umpires will decide out of that. It looks like... Uh, USA are going forwards and Jamaica are retreating, so it's going to be a penalty from the spot in favor of the home team. Still only two goals in it after that huge goal fest. 11 to 9, here comes Rory. Sends a big, strong shot up the field, but the only person who's going to get there first is uh, Kurt Kirchin. What a backhand from him. Shane's turning it onto it quickly. The two number fours fighting for it. They cancel each other out. They leave the ball there for Cameron. Cameron waits, sends it forward for Jamaica. It's going to run over the back line, though. Couldn't quite control it. All right, ball on the back line. Two minutes, 40 seconds. Rory on that grey pony brings the ball in. Comes across the face. Kurt waiting for him. Sam making a run. This could be a great move. There it is, the great move. Rory saw Sam, and Sam was open. He got the first touch. There's Shane defending. Sam's picked it up. Sam's just trying to push it towards the goal. He's got one more chance. But Cameron Waits comes in with the ride off, takes Sam out of it, and the ball runs over the back line harmlessly. So Jamaica get the hit in. It's there, Shane Chin to bring it in. He's got his brother Kurt over on this side. Over there, he's got Cameron in the middle. He's got Dougie. He sends the ball towards his brother. Brother Kurt and uh, Sam take each other out. Here comes Dougie Henderson. Dougie gets a touch. Can Cameron get onto it? I think he can. Cameron does really well. He gets onto it. Now he's got to get the under the next shot. Dan's riding him off, pushes him way out wide. Good play from Keating, good defensive play. Now we've got Kurt getting in there with Dan Keating. Kurt and Dan. Kurt's got it. Can he bring it across the middle? He's left it behind. Who's there? Shane's there, is he? There's that Dougie, Shane. Looks like Shane's got it. He's run under Chris Fragg. The Jamaicans are doing well. They're not giving up this ball. They've still got it. It's come across the middle. Can we get the backhand here? Little cut backhand. Oh, he misses it. Doesn't get the contact. Rory gets hooked. Dan Keating gets the shot away, though. Dougie rides out Rory. Where's the ball? It's Kurt. Kurt's going to just slow down. He's going to try and get it to himself. He's done well. He's got to get around Dan. Shane's there as well. Sam Clements is there. Where's that ball? It's going to be for Shane Chin. Shane just pushes it forward. He's got a chance running at goal. Oh, it comes off Rory's pony. Dan couldn't get the backhand. Now Chris fragomeni has got all the time in the world, Chris. Turns it. Oh, it comes off his cane. Kurt's back onto it now. Kurt's going to turn it. Yes, he is. Kurt's turning it. Great pressure from Jamaica. You'd think they probably deserve a goal from this. Rory gets in the way again, but he can't stop it. And Kurt Chin scores for Jamaica. Double digits for Jamaica now. 11-11, 30-second bell going. Ball is dead. That will end the fifth chucker. Wow, we got one more checker. Seven and a half more minutes. You all the love and happiness you deserve on this special day. All right, game's away, and Jamaica score. Oh, wow. That makes it 11-all. Fantastic. 11-all, seven minutes. If I was good at maths, I could tell you how many minutes have already gone in this match. Seven times five, 35, 35, 40 minutes. And it's 11-all with six 
and a bit minutes to go. Jamaica now going down towards the Jumbotron. It's just gone one way than the other. It's great. It's wonderful. Here comes Dougie through the pack. Dougie gets the ball. Can he get the near side? The offside can't. Rory Torrey gets a great tail backhand. First on it, though, is Cameron. Cameron. Oh, look at that. Shane made room for Cameron. Cameron done well. Cameron's done very well. Cameron has done more than very well. Cameron has just put Jamaica back in the lead today. How many lead changes? How brilliant is this? Crikey, not only have we got a lovely, lovely day, but we've got a great match of polo going on. Absolutely spoiled. Dan should double the price of everybody's tickets. This is a great game. Absolutely. All right, he doesn't have to. No, no, just joking. All right, where are we going? Where are we going? Team is lined up. Momentum back with Jamaica for a second. Sam Clements picks up the ball, trying to start the attack for USA. Sam doing really well, but he's ridden out of it by Dougie. Dan Keating gets a good touch towards the middle. Dougie Henderson's there. Dougie gets a little bit of a backhand. Dan Keating picks it up. Oh, it's left behind. Shane Chin tries to put it through the middle. Sam Clement's going to get the backhand. Sam does. It's going to run out wide, though, is it? Yeah, it just runs out wide. Jamaica. Sigh, a little bit of relief there. They've got a couple of seconds to breathe in. Shane's going to bring the ball back into play. He's looking upfield. Ernie blows his whistle, stops the clock. He just wants to put the ball where it went wide. All right, Shane to bring it in. Shane tries to find his brother, Kurt. He's pushing it past Chris. Kurt's onto it. Kurt picks it up with a big shot. Look at that bounce off the boards. That's kind for him. He's looking at goal. He's got it all. Oh, took the eye off the ball. He saw the goal. Who's onto this? Rory Torrey trying to get control of it. Cameron waits, not let him have any time at all. Rory's done brilliant. He's escaped Cameron. Can he get up the field now? It's behind the saddle. He can't. Here comes Sam Clements. Sam puts it back in front of Rory. Rory, Shane Chin's there. Rory and Shane take each other out of it. Great backhand from Cameron. Kurt turns really quick. Can he take the ball? No, he can't. Chris Frag, bit slow from Chris. Chris, now he's got a chance, though. He's got a chance. He needs to hit away. He does. It's looking good, too. It is. It is. It is good. 12 all. 12 all. Four minutes, 30 seconds. Jamaica just can't hang on to that lead when they get it. USA attack it right back. All right. Jamaica now going down towards the Jumbotron. What's going on? Ernie waiting for them to line up. Good. In comes the ball. Chris steals it. Having just scored. Kurt. Chin gets a lovely backhand. Cameron picks it up. He's got Shane right behind him. Cameron's still going with it, though. He needs to center it. Rory just shadowing him. Kurt slows it down. Can he turn it towards the middle? Dan trying to get to him. Kurt's... No. Oh, brilliant from Cameron. Cameron's still got it. Cameron's still got it. No way. There's Kurt. Can Kurt get the little shot? It's left there. Surely Shane Chin can score. He does. Oh, he doesn't. I can't see. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, it's wide. Hit into USA. That was a big let off. Shane will discuss that lucky belt after that, miss. Ooh, dear, oh dear. Right. Rory to bring the ball in. He's got Dan a little unmarked. The Jamaicans are being a little, little loosey goosey with the marking at the moment. Rory brings it towards Kurt. Sam's running. Shane trying to pick it out the air. Doesn't enough. Oh, Sam Clements picks it up. Shane needs to get there. Shane on the near side. He does enough to put, get it away. Dan Keating on the near side. Dan attacking the goal. Can the USA get the goal back? Dan, oh, he's hooked. Rory's there. Rory, oh, Rory pulls it too much across the face of the goal. It's going to run out. He had a bit of a chance. Either team could have taken the lead. Shane Chin at one end. Rory at this end. Hit in to Jamaica. Two minutes, 48 seconds. All good stuff. Crikey. All right, Shane Chin tries to send the big shot up the field, but Dan's going to try and wait for it. Kurt's got a chance to pick it up. Shane's going to come through the pack. Shane does. Dougie's got a chance on the near side. Bounces away. His horse kicks it forward. Rory Torrey just gets a touch. Shane picks it up. This is a chance for Shane. Shane, can he? Can he? Yes, he can. I think Shane and the lucky belt have scored. Someone needs to have a word with that goal judge about where he's supposed to be and what he's supposed to do. But there you go. Anyway, Jamaica, 13 to 12, 25 goals. My over and under was 19. What an absolute pathetic, 
attempt by me to judge what's going to happen in this game. I did say it was going to be close, and I said Jamaica by one. Yeah, you're just trying to cover for yourself. Right, where is it? Who's coming out with it? Jamaica come out. Rory Torrey gets to the backhand, though. Three of his mates are there. Somehow, Kurt Chin gets a shot. Chris Fragg's going over there. Chris gets across. Where is it? Who's got it? Brilliant from Cameron. Cameron, Rory Torrey. Rory Torrey turning it. He's got a minute, 30 seconds. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Riding off from Shane. But the ball's still there. Riding off from, from Dougie now. Can Rory get it? Not really. Sam. Oh, he gets well hooked. Oh, someone doesn't like that. Big call from the umpire. Says it's going to go in favour of the red team. Oh. oh, good. He's going to do a roll in. He's agreed with me. I got something right today. All right, roll in. Perry just wants a nice line. We've got a minute 24. Yeah, come on. USA trying to just gain a little foot or two. In comes the ball. Who's got it? It bounces out for Jamaica. <gasps> Kurt just comes through. But I think he got the foul that time. I think. I think he should have played it on the near side. I think that's what Ernie's saying, and I agree with Ernie. So it's a penalty in favor of the home team. The Reds, USA, a penalty from the spot. Jamaica retreat 30 yards. Gosh, Kurt must be thinking, if only I'd played it on the near side, I could have had that, but he didn't. He played it on the offside. Sorry, horses have right and left like everybody else, but, you know, as in yachting, you have port and starboard. Horses have the offside, which is the right, and the near side, which is the left. So I'm sorry if I'm confused anybody. Anyway, play. Here we go. Minute 19. Rory taps it in. He's got Dan Keating backing him up. He's got two Jamaicans waiting for it. Cameron goes to Dan Keating. Kurt waits for Rory. Kurt's still waiting for Rory. Rory looking at goals. Fires it. Oh, is it up? Is it up? Is it good? It's going to run wide. Shane's going, phew, I'm going to let that run out. Minute. Now, are Jamaica going to be clever and waste this minute? Can they just keep control of the ball? We're ready. Kurt's back on, is he? Yep, yeah, Kurt's on. Shane's bringing it in. He's going well wide with it, but across the face of his goal. Rory's going to try and get in the way. Chris is waiting for him. Shane doesn't get the shot he needed. He's left it there for Rory. Rory's got it. Rory's away. Rory could even this up. 39 seconds. Oh, no, he's missed it. Oh, my God, what happened? Kurt's cleared it. Kurt's, Kurt, Kurt's cleared it up the field. It's gone out. It's gone out. There's a 30-second bell. They've still got time. Can he get the ball down? They've still got time. Jamaica needs to defend. Clock's not stopping. They can attack it. 18 seconds. Rory, go. 15 seconds. Here comes Rory. Look at that. That's a great approach shot. Jamaica, desperate. Sam Clements. He scored with seven seconds. Oh, my God. Seven seconds to go. And Sam Clements ties it up. 13 all. Rory set it up for him. Jamaica must be going, oh, no. Oh, brilliant. What are we going to do now? Dan Keating, is it going to be the first over the back line? A quick throw in, first over back line wins it. That's what we usually do for internationals. Put some music on. All right, they're doing the sudden death. It's all to play for. The first team to get the ball over the back line, not through the goal, over the back line, wins. They're just going to stay on these horses. It's going to be very quick. We're not going to put any time on the clock. We don't need time on the clock. It's 13 all. Oh, my goodness. Shane, tighten that lucky belt one more notch. 
Sam Clemens, the Sam Clemens, could you make a winning shot? Dan Keating, our beloved president. Rory Torrey's played brilliant. There's not one man of the match today, you know. Everybody has played brilliant. Actually, if I had to pick someone, I'd go with Cameron. All right, first over the bat line wins. Ready to cheer? Both teams deserve a cheer. In's the ball. Rory picks it up. Can he get away? Yes, he can. This is looking good. He missed that goal. Can he hit this one? He's hit it. It's got the legs. Somebody's going with him. Rory Torrey's hit it hard enough. USA, get it over the bat line. USA, run out winners. What a match. Absolutely brilliant. Oh, my God. That's fabulous fun. Absolutely brilliant. I'm sorry Jamaica didn't win much, but well done, USA. That means that damn Ann Clements takes the trophy home with her. She's got to polish it a lot better than she did last week. All right, sweaty hand slappy, everybody. If you'd like to 